What is going on everyone? Welcome back to this channel. Uh, we just arrived to the store. We drove two hours to get here to Animal House Pets and Supplies. Now I've been here to this store already, you know, once to record. So just in case you guys want to watch, you know, basically uh, the entire store, you know, make sure to check out that video. So thanks to Dan, you know, I'm gonna be able to get a, a couple of these uh, very rare geckos. Man, they look amazing. I just want to, uh, I just want to have them already. So we're gonna go inside the store. You know, make sure uh, that uh, you know they look fine. Which you know, I'm pretty sure that uh, they do. I know that uh, Dan really takes good care of his reptiles. So let's go in, ask some questions, make sure that everything is good, and we're gonna go get them. Alright guys, so finally we are back here in my reptile room after two and a half hours of driving. So here they are. These are two Australian leaf tail geckos from different clutches. These are not clutch mates. Man, these geckos are so freaking cool looking. You know, obviously I like the name says they are from Australia from a place called Mount Elliot. So to be honest, I don't think that it's uh, actually a mountain where they come from, I believe it's a, it's a city and they come from a part of that city. Man, look at them. They are so freaking cool. These are, probably, these are probably my favorite of them. I am so happy that I got them. You know, to care for these uh, geckos, it's uh, it's very easy. I mean, it's uh, basically like, like taking care of a, of a crested gecko. You know, you know they need um, a taller setup. They're, you, you're not really gonna find them too much on the floor. Now, this is you know the very first time that I'm gonna take care of uh, of any leaf tail geckos. But you know, I have done my research and asked the very few people that uh, that I can. These are purely insectivores. So they will only be eating insects. Their setup is ready. Look at that. Man, so freaking cool. So this right here, this is the male. Okay. You. Go right there. Elliot, come back. Alright, so this right here, this is my female, and to be honest, I love more the uh, the colors of her. I like that uh, she's actually brighter, even though he does a better job at hiding. Alright, so to be specific, you know, the, uh, the name of the species is, I cannot pronounce that. <laughs> so that's why I usually go with the, uh, with the common name, and their common names, they actually have two which are kind of common is the riverine gecko or you know leaf tail gecko or the mount elliot leaf tail gecko and you know since they come from mount elliot is uh, actually what normally most people know them from and because of that i have decided that since i have a male and a female i'm gonna name them my male elliot and my female olivia i'm really happy that uh, that i got to to work with these species you know, they're gonna be together, so I'm hoping that uh, we get some eggs in the future. And you know, I want to say first of all, thank you to my wife, because uh, you know, she went with me to get them, which was almost five hours in the car. It's not fun. And thank you to Dan, you know, for helping me get this awesome species. So I'm about to uh, put them in their enclosure. Uh, you, will, you guys will see that in the next video. 
and hopefully they will get to eat probably right away if not then soon but all right guys well thank you so much for watching i really hope that you guys enjoyed these videos if you guys have any comments you know please make sure to leave it in the comment section and i will see you next week